are the young tech people like to eat? What, what's their restaurant zone? <laughs> I'm not sure it's that different. I, it's been interesting going to all the new restaurants because you see a wide range. I don't think that, that we're as segregated as far as age as, as other cities mm -hmm. because I think older people seem younger and younger people have the money that they can eat like the older people. Yes, informally, but informally, but, at, but, at that but, but they can spend level. the money. Yep. Yep. I mean, because the restaurants I do are really in the upper echelons of, of cost. Right. Um, and it used to be in the 80s, it would be mostly the older affluent crowd. About eight years ago, I remember I was lamenting the death of the fixed price menu and the high upper end menus like mm. the Ernie's. Um, you know, there were, there were none yeah. or very few. It's turned it's come around. roaring back. Yeah. yeah, and again, I think it's it's interesting if you if you go back and look at the history of why. I think one is is the fact that it's more economical for restaurants to do that because you don't have to have you know twenty. The other big trend is shortened menus. I mean, you know, yes. there'll be a dozen things on the menu instead of thirty eight. Yep. I'm on this the James Beard Restaurant Committee, and we get together yes. four oh, times a year. Yes, that must be fascinating. It's, it's interesting because we started yeah. a few years ago. We started meeting in other cities so that we can check out the food right. in, in those cities. A year ago, in January, they all came to San Francisco. And so I gave them a list. They checked it out, and several people went to Bennu. Mm -hmm. And I remember one person said, you know, it was, it was great, but, man, I felt rushed because the food just kept coming and kept coming and kept coming. And I finally, we finally asked him to slow down. And then talking to other people, I realized that people in other parts of the world, when they come for a tasting meeting, you expect to spend three or four hours. In San Francisco, people don't want to spend it. So restaurants like Cezanne and Bennu will do the 18 courses, but they know to get it out fast because that's what the public wants. Oh, that's wants. very interesting. And so you have, and it was a dynamic I didn't even realize until I was talking to these people. But it's again, we're adapting to our clientele here because people don't mind the tasting menus, but they're impatient to spend three hours. That's interesting, you know, whereas in a classic French restaurant, you know, you, the dinner, the, the table is yours. Right.